This is a video I just put out a love hate on my uh I'll get it down. Uh, I did a video on this Gibson Flying V and my love hate vlog. And I said this was a parts guitar. This is a video of me putting together this guitar from me unboxing it and adding all the parts. It doesn't look anything like this in the end, but it was a stage. Um, yeah, so enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think. Talk about it. Let's do it. A do it yourself, a build it yourself. Um, this is a guitar, a uh, Gibson 2019 Flying V that I got on Stratosphere off of eBay. Um, it is this natural, it's got a gloss finish, it's a mahogany body, rosewood neck, the frets are pretty thin, but you know, whatever, I've got a Telecaster with thin frets and it sounds amazing because, uh, the strings really resonate right off the fretboard and it just gives it a nice tone, but I've got extra pickups, I've got uh, the bridge and saddle are coming in the mail and then I've got lock and tuners for it um, but yeah I didn't show the unboxing it came in all this bubble wrap and it's double boxed in this big box and it looks like it came from Chicago Music Exchange reverb I don't know what they do, like, they get like a defective Gibson and then they take off all the parts and sell you the body or something. I don't know. One thing I realize is work from the top down makes it a lot easier. On the other side, I went from the bottom up. And then, you know, you have to reach in between them to get the screws in the holes. But if you go from the top down, it's just easy. It's, it's like made to be put on that way. All right, we got our uh, package in the mail. Guys sold us. He said came off of Gibson. Alright, here we've got our wiring kit for the EMG signature Zach Wilde, James Hetfield, and 5766. Set, which is the 5766. These are, I bought a couple of headsets for other guitars and then the beauty with active pickups that Seymour Duncan did is they use the same wiring uh, harness as the EMG so you can just plug and play. Let's see, they both have three pins set up. This is the bridge pickup ring. As you can see, this side is fatter and this side is slimmer. So this side's gonna be facing the neck. This side's gonna be facing the bridge. So when we put our pickup in, we want it facing like that. That way we can read the pickup and that's the north and the south. So 
make sure you all right got these uh pickup rings they're uh, pro line guitar parts pickup rings uh, gonna be installing a whole slew of pickups I think I'm gonna go with these these are the EMG 5766 set but I'm also gonna try something I got from a a YouTube uh, comment somebody suggested we'll try a uh, I got the Duncan Blackout set that I stole out of a guitar of, I once had. So I'm going to put the neck pickup in with my favorite old school EMG, which is the EMG 60. I like this in the bridge. It has a, a real full mid-range and it just gives a lot of punch to the guitar. It's a lot better than the 81. Try it sometime. So, you see I've got my guitar basically done. I'm missing a, uh, a knob. But I, I put together the pick guard out of this piece of uh, laminate bathroom tile. I basically just put it in two pieces. This piece is to cover the body cavity where the electronics go. I would have two pickups in this guitar as a normal guitar, you know, just like this ESP right here. But the body cavity in here is so small and I'm not an expert at knowing the exact dimensions and looking at the back of the pickguard. It's a mess. I've got a battery like wedged right in here I think and then the uh, the wiring harness hub is like right here just uh, pretty tight quarters in there. I've just got one volume knob and output jack and really that's that's all I need because I just like playing this guitar for the chugs and you know for the the sweet riffing and I closed in up here this neck pickup cavity favorite GHS 10 to 52 boomers on here and I wrap the tailpiece personally I I don't hear any difference in the uh, in the tonal quality, but I feel like it makes the string a little springy, springier or spongier feeling. It's it, it's just a feel thing. I really enjoy it.